I love this game, and there's not a fucking deck Konami could make that would make me quit this game. I mean, I'll admit that I get irritated, just like any other player, get a little annoyed whenever certain decks make certain plays. You know, Dark Worlds, go first, open up card destruction, get five Dark World effects, whatever, you know. Yeah, that's irritating, but, you know, it's just whatever. I don't get mad. No point in getting mad. First Dino Rabbit slash Macro Rabbit. Logia first turn, set four, go. Well, you just basically said, fuck you. But all right. I'm not going to get mad. New E-Dragons. First turn. Uh, Draco Sack. Light and Darkness Dragon. It's whatever. You know, I don't get mad. I get annoyed at best. But I don't let it bother me. Because facing these decks anyway, I go in not expecting a whole lot. I have terrible matchups with Dark Worlds. <clears throat> I haven't faced Dragon Rulers yet. Maybe like, well, once or twice on Death Crow. But you know I just don't let it get to me but what does get to me is the dumbass motherfucker playing the deck there's something about these stupid ass people and I'm not saying everybody don't get fucking offended certain motherfuckers just play these decks to annoy your ass and they'll just sit there and glare at you once they make these plays and just smile like and be like alright motherfucker you want me to just get mad and yell is that what you want which I'm pretty sure that's what it is they play these decks just to piss you off they don't give a damn if it tops they don't give a fuck about that they just want to piss people off and these motherfuckers is what really gets to me because they the same ass motherfuckers that get pissed off when you make a comeback and beat them. They basically been just saying fuck you this whole game. Being rude as fuck. Just being a general ass. And then they get mad when you come back and win. It happens to me every week when I duel. I gotta deal with some dumbass. Maybe it's just my area. Or maybe I'm just not a people person, which I'm not at all. I'm not a people person. I'm not sociable. It's the reason I don't go to regionals. I got anxiety issues. I'd be flipping my shit if I go there and nobody wants that. But, you know, but still. I just, <clears throat> I don't get mad at this game. I get mad at the players. I love the game. I'll play through any deck. I just wish people had improved their damn attitudes. That is what rustles my jimmies. Fucking people in their damn attitudes in this game. It's a fucking game. You're at locals. It doesn't make a shit difference what you fucking do, what you don't do, what you draw, what you don't draw. If this was regionals or higher, I could understand you getting this damn attitude. This is fucking locals. Get over it. Prime example. I'm playing Mermails. You see where this is going. I'm playing a Mermail player. At the time, I'm using Infernities. Not the new Synchro, or not the new Exceed, the old Synchros. The old Synchro build. I end up winning this match because I get the loop off. I get three barriers sit. I have Void Ogre. I got Infernity Doom Dragon out. I'm feeling pretty good. This motherfucker scares the shit out of me. His next turn, he goes through Void Ogre's effect and three damn barriers. I'm like, oh fuck, he's gonna come back and win this. 
And at that point, I was pretty sure I was going to lose because he went through that many resources. I was like, well, shit, he's got something up his sleeve. Either that or he's just trying to freak me out, which he's fucking doing. He goes through all this and then passes because he ain't got shit left. I was about to say, like, dude, if you come and win this after that, I won't even be mad. I won't be irritated. I won't be nothing. In fact, I'll be so amazed I will go over there to you and hug you for that. That would be amazing. But of course, he just passed the turn and then he comes to me. So I just sit on Void Ogre and in front of Doom Dragon. I don't do nothing else because I already went through three barriers. I just beat down with him two. Infernity effect, destroy his monster, Void Ogre attack. You know, I just do that until he loses. Dude gets fucking attitude with me. Of course, I expected that. And starts going off after I win. I get the match, of course, both games. I 2 owed it. Because I got the loop off both times. And he gets this attitude. He goes off on a 10 minute speech about how I'm a bad player, how my deck takes no skill, which what deck fucking does, but you know, he goes off on this and tells me how I could have, how I misplayed so horribly and I could have won earlier. I'm sitting there thinking, motherfucker, I already won. It doesn't make a shit difference what I did. Maybe I didn't misplay. Maybe it's called strategy. But he's just in this pissy mood and gives me a 10 minute fucking speech on why he's still a better player than me. <clears throat> and then like, I ain't got a problem with a guy. In fact, I like the dude. It's just when he loses, he gets a damn attitude and just has to give me these speeches. So after that, I go off, I get my win. I'm like, well, fuck, whatever. He starts talking behind my back to his pro buddies. About how he just lost to a scrub with infernities with reprinted barriers. I'm like, okay, you're talking behind my back now. <clears throat> but whatever, I still don't give a fuck. I got the win. You can bitch about it all you want. I don't give a fuck. Cause I'm here. I'm not. I'm the nicest guy in the world. I don't get mad. If I get irritated, I don't say shit. I'm like, okay, you did that. Awesome. And this motherfucker just goes off on me, and I've been nothing but nice to him. See, it's just these motherfuckers, these players like this, that give me these attitudes, <clears throat> and I don't do shit. I try to be nice. Maybe I'm just gonna have to be a dick fuck like these guys and just <clears throat> go off. Another example, one more example, because this video is gonna be long ass. I'm gonna try to keep this short. I don't wanna bore you too much. Playing Mermels again. I had relatively good luck against Mermels when they first came out. Playing Insectors. Second or third turn, I get an OTK. 8,000 to zero. One damn turn. OTK. I don't know what, I don't even know what the fuck I did. It's something about I pop my own guys, get two searches off Dragonfly. Equip, equip, equip with some shit. I don't know. I have. It was some shit. I don't know what had happened, but I OTK'd him. This motherfucker tells me, okay, you misplayed, and I'll tell you what you did wrong after the match. I just look at him like, what the fuck? I OTK'd your ass and you're telling me I misplayed? I don't give a fuck. I fucking dropped you to zero in one damn turn. I don't give a fuck how I misplayed. I fucking won the match. And this motherfucker is... He just pissed off like the other guy. His damn godlike mermaids lost. That rustles my jimmies. And I'm going to encounter this just enti my entire Yu Gi Oh! playing career, I suppose. Which I don't suppose I fucking know. There's always going to be some dumbass playing this game. And I'm always going to play them. But you. You know, I just want to do a little rant here about what rustles my jimmies in Yu-Gi-Oh. Share a little story or two. But, I don't get mad at the game. No, like my original point. So, you know, the game's not worth getting mad at. I love the game. The people, 
the people aren't even worth getting mad at. I do get, I get frustrated with the people. But that's just you, Gil. And this video's pushing nine minutes, almost ten minutes now, so I'm gonna stop here. All our thirty some odd subscribers, my rant videos don't get many views anyway. But if you did watch this, thank you. I'm going to try to be more interesting in future videos, but if you watch this, I really do appreciate it. Thank you. And I'll try to make something more interesting. I'll try to do better videos, but I'm going to shut up now. Thank you and good night, good day.